everyone. Um, happy spring and welcome to Blue Laces Theatre Company's exclusive Suds at Home. My name is Amanda and I write music for all things Blue Laces. All the shows, all of the things, all the little ditties. Um, I get the absolute pleasure of writing. And today we're doing my absolute favorite song from Suds, The Laundry Blues about our pal Gregory who just has way too much laundry to do and we have to get him super excited about doing laundry. Right, here we go. Poor, poor Gregory didn't know what to do. So much dirty clothes, laundry day was overdue. There's washing, sorting, drying, folding, couldn't see it through. So he became a laundry monster and sang the laundry blues. Boo-hoo, he's got the laundry blues. Piles of dirty clothes so high, he didn't know what to do. Boo-hoo, so sad he said I do. He became the laundry monster singing boo, laundry boo. Explain to our buddy Gregory how fun it is to do laundry. Sorting's like help in all our clothes, find a friend. Washing's like a bath, the bubble party never ends. Then we'll dry them up so they don't catch a cold. And then we'll put our clothes to bed. How? Well, we'll fold. I was the original props designer for Suds, and I'm going to show you how to make the Suds blower that we used in the show. So here's some of the things you're going to need. First, you're going to want to find a small plastic bottle. Now you can use a water bottle or a soda bottle or any small bottle. I have a few other examples here, like this little spritzer. You're just going to want to make sure that the neck of the bottle is pretty small and that the bottle is made from plastic because we're going to be cutting it. You could also use something like a pill bottle or a soap dispenser. Now you're going to want to also have on hand some dish soap. I like to use the blue or the green kind that says it's gentle on hands. Some water, a small bowl, a pair of scissors, and some fabric. Now here I have an old t-shirt. You could also use an old sock or a dish towel or anything that's pretty thin and clean and that you can cut. And you'll also want some small rubber bands. Now you might also want to have on hand a large bowl and a towel and a tray just in case things get really sudsy. All right, I'm going to show you how to make the blower now. Start by taking the plastic bottom, take the top off, and you're going to want to get an adult to help you cut off the bottom. Now I already did it here, but it's pretty tricky to do. And you're going to want to make sure that you only cut off the bottom. So that's why you might need an adult's help. Once you've done that, you're going to take the fabric and cut a small square. And make sure that this square is big enough so that it will fit over the bottom of the bottle. That is the part that we just cut off and hang over the sides a good amount. So, as you can see, the next step is to lay that fabric over the end of the bottle, just like that. And you can see I'm pinning it on this end of the bottle, not the part which has the small neck. Now, once it's around the bottom of the bottle, I'll take my rubber band, and this here might be the trickiest part. You're gonna wrap the rubber band around the bottle like this, making sure that you secure that fabric really tightly around the bottom because you want to make sure it doesn't slip off. I wrap the rubber band around twice to make sure it's pretty secure. 
So that's the blower. The next step is to make the suds fluid. So I'll take my small bowl and pour in just about a tablespoon or two of water. It doesn't have to be too exact. Then I'll take my soap and put in a good squirt. These things don't have to be too exact, but you want to make sure that it's just about one part soap to two parts water. And now I'm mixing up that suds fluid. And here's where the towel and all these other things will come in handy. So I've got my tray and my towel and my big bowl. Now it's time to use the blower. I dip it in. And as you can see, this part is where our mouth goes. We blow in and the suds will come out the other side. Let's see if it works. Ooh. Wow, that's a fun one. Let's try these other two I made. Now you can experiment with the amount of soap you have in your suds fluid. Maybe it'll change the consistency of your suds. And you can also play with different types of blowers. Let's see what this big one is like. <clears throat> have fun. You know what today is? It's laundry day, yeah! Me and Bubbles are gonna do all of the laundry. I'm so excited. Hey, Bubbles! Bubbles, are you ready? Oh, where did she go? Let's see what's here. Hey, Bubbles! Come on, come on. Bubbles? I think she's in there. Bubbles, what's the... What's the matter? Looks like she's got a bad case of the laundry blues. Come on, Bubbles. It ain't gonna be that bad. <laughs> you wanna try it our way? Okay. First step, sorting. Or as I like to think of it, helping our clothes find their friends.
it's time to wash up all the clothes We need water to fill up the tubs Swirl in the water around to get ready for the suds Suds, suds, we need a lot of suds to wash away the dirt and the mud. Yeah, a lot! Time to scrub a dub dub, all the bubbles make it fun. Okay, I must admit, this is pretty fun. What's next? Lunch you clean to the suds you say goodbye. See you later. Who needs a washing machine? It's your turn to try. Oh, me? Seems like we just begun, but we're almost done. Really? We're almost, almost. done? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh man, I can't wait for the next part. This is my favorite part. Really? Yeah. And to that we say, hooray! Wow, that sure was fun! All right, I guess laundry isn't all that bad. I told you. <laughs> suds, suds, scrub a dub dub! Third step, drying. Or as I like to think of it, warming up.
Wait, Bubbles, we still have one more step. Oh. <laughs> Looks like you and these clothes are ready to take a nap. Our clothes have had a day so exciting. Now they're soft as sheep. They'll need some sleep for adventures at its time to go to bed. We'll fold the shirt arms into each other. Home are staying safe and fighting those long